Hello friends, today in this video I am going to discuss about the MCQs on general microbiology and this is the ninth part of the series of 500 MCQs on general microbiology. So let's start the question answer session with explanation on microbiology. So the first question of this series of videos that is iodine in gram stain act as a modern decolorizer primary stain or counter stain and the right answer is option A that is mordant. So iodine in gram stain act as a mordant. So this iodine act as a mordant by binding to the crystal violet that is the primary stain of gram, gram stain and so that together they will be too large to be removed by the decolorizer. So mordant iodine bind with the crystal violet to <coughs> Uh, tightly packed with uh, the gram positive bacteria so that they cannot be removed by the decolorizer treatment okay so move on to the next question that is motility of a bacterium is demonstrated by iodine preparation india ink preparation hanging drop preparation or lactophenol cotton blue preparation and the right answer is option c that is hanging drop preparation and here we can see this is the hanging drop method. So this one is the glass slide where a curved is present here. And on the cover sleeve, at first on the cover sleeve, the specimen, a drop of liquid specimen is added on the cover sleeve and then we invert the cover sleeve on the petroleum jelly. Okay, in this condition, we at first <coughs> drop a specimen and uh, drop a liquid specimen on the cover sleeve and we invert it like this and in this position we observe them on microscope okay to observe the motility of the bacteria so next question is asbestos filter are chemically made of kaolin and sand kisel gur kisel gur and magnesium silicate or cellulose acetate and the right answer is option c that is magnesium silicate is the <coughs> component by which asbestos filter made and here we can see asbestos filter is a disposable single use disc that is high absorbing tendency and it is a it is carcinogenic and used in the cigarette this one okay so move on to the next question that is L forms are named after Louis Pasteur, Lister Institute, Leeuwenhoek or Landsteiner and the right answer is option B that is Lister Institute is represented by, represented by L and what is L form bacteria? This L form bacteria cell, uh, is a cell wall deficient bacteria which are growth which are growth from derived uh, are growth from derived from the different bacteria. They lack cell wall, peptidoglycan is absent in them. So here we can see this is the bacterial L form. So L form means they lack the cell wall. Okay. So cell, if the cell wall lack in gram positive bacteria, then it is called the protoplast. And if the cell wall lack in the gram negative bacteria, then it is called spheroplast. Okay. So two type of L forms are present that is protoplast and spheroplast and the next one is the log phase in the bacterial growth curve comes after lack phase, stationary phase, phase of decline or phase of rise and the right answer is option A. So after log phase the lack so after uh, lack phase the log phase comes. So here we can see this is the first step that is lack phase where no increase in number of bacterial cells. So here the size of the cell increases okay and then this one this one is the log phase where exponential increase in number of living bacterial cell so cell divided exponentially or cell number increases exponentially okay so move on to the next question that is which bacteria can survive at 5 degrees celsius vibrio cholerae pseudomonas aeruginosa escherichia coli or shigella dysentery and the right answer is option b that is pseudomonas aeruginosa and this is also called the <coughs> psychrophile. Okay, so move on to the next. That is Brown's Brown's tube or Brown's tube or yellow spot is used for sterilization control of dry heat, moist heat, pasteurization, or tindalization. And the right answer is option B, moist heat. 
so brown stew or yellow spot is used for the sterilization control of moist heat like autoclave so here a tube is present uh, this cap is allows the steam to penetrate inside <coughs> and this is a tube where in the uh, nutrient media is present and here endospores of bacillus stereothermophilus is present so when the or, or after autoclave the flexible valve is squeezed to break the ampule and release the medium onto the spores so medium and medium is in contact with the spores so if the autoclaving is done properly then no color change will be seen because the no uh, or, no, no spores come to the vegetative form so if the autoclave doesn't work properly so that it uh, the <coughs> culture come the culture color of the cul culture media the color of the culture media will be yellow because yellow medium means spores are viable autoclave objects are not sterile okay so this is the sterility test for the moist is sterilization or autoclaving okay so move on to the next that is that is operation theaters can be sterilized by all of the following except 40 percent formaldehyde potassium permanganate and formaldehyde or two percent glutaraldehyde or bacilloid and the right answer is option c that is two percent glutaraldehyde is not used in the operation theater and next one is the cystoscope and Bronchoscopes are sterilized by 10% formaldehyde, 2% glutaraldehyde, 1% sodium hypochlorite, and 5% cresol. And the right answer is option B. That is, 2% glutaraldehyde is used to sterilize the cystoscope and bronchoscope. Okay, and next one is all are selective media for Vibrio quality except Biosalt agar, deoxycholate citrate agar, GTT agar or TCBS agar and the right answer is option B deoxycholate citrate agar is not used for as a selective media for vibrio quality. So this deoxycholate citrate agar mainly used or suitable for isolation of dysentery bacilli, food poisoning salmonella, salmonella paratyphi or, or for shigella and it is a heat sensitive media it should be should not be autoclaved or melted remelted okay. So next one is the carry player medium is a selective medium or enrichment medium or enriched enriched medium or enrichment medium or transport medium and the right answer is option D that is transport medium. So this carry player transport medium is a simple semi solid non nutritive medium used for the collection and preservation of microbiological specimens the minimal nutrient in the medium facilitate facilitate the survival of organism without multiplication okay so this is used as a transport medium to transport from one one area to another and next one is the lg medium is as, as usually prepared in wide mou mouthed bottle baizu bottle or mccartney bottle or raux bottles and the right answer is option c mccartney's bottle okay and this Lowenstein Jensen medium is, uh, <clears throat> is when grown on LG medium, mycobacterium tuberculosis appear as brown granular colonies, sometimes called buff, rough, and tough. The medium must be incubated for a significant length of time, as usually for weeks, due to the slow doubling time of mycobacterium tuberculosis so this lj medium is basically used for the growth of mycobacterium tuberculosis and here this is the mccartney bottle okay so next question is for preparation of blood agar blood is added to nutrient agar gradually at a temperature of option a that is 50 degrees celsius and this is the composition of blood agar and this is the blood agar plate and and how to prepare this blood agar so at first heat with agitation to dissolve the agar and autoclave 15 minutes at 121 degrees celsius and then cool to 50 degrees celsius and after that at 5 ml defibrinated sheep red blood cells to 100 ml melted agar and then mix and pour 20 ml portion of the sterile petri dish so move on to the next question that is 
for blood culture 5 ml to 10 ml of blood is inoculated in 5 ml or 10 ml of medium or 10 ml to 20 ml of medium 20 to 40 ml of medium or 50 to 100 ml of medium and right answer is option D so 5 to 10 ml of blood is inoculated into 50 to 100 ml of medium and the next one is the technique of sterilization where introduced by Louis Pasteur, Robert Scotch, Edward Jenner or Paul Ehrlich and the right answer is option B Robert Scotch okay so sterilization is introduced by Robert Scotch and the research of Robert Scotch and his associates in 1881 on the disinfecting properties of steam and hot air mark the beginning of the science of disinfection and sterilization they devised the first non-pressure flowing steam sterilizer okay so next one is the kingdom protista include bacteria protozoa fungi or all of the above and the right answer is option d that is all of the above and the following bacterium in is cellular deficient cellular deficient bacteria is mycoplasma Triponema, Staphylococcus or Klebsiella and the right answer is option A that is mycoplasma and this is the mycoplasma structure where no cell wall is present here okay so move to the next question that is the chemical nature of capsule may be polysaccharide polypeptide both of the above or none of the above and the right answer is option C that is both of the above are the constituent of bacterial capsule structure that is the polysaccharide and polypeptide and this capsule is a thick layer of slime layer material which is present outside of the bacterial surface and composed of polysaccharide and polypeptide and it is also called glycocalyx and not essential for cell viability and found in both gram positive and gram negative bacteria and it is also present in outside of the cell wall and when it is well defined when the capsule is well defined it is called capsule and when less defined it is called slime layer okay so next one is the McConkey's medium is an example of transport medium indicator medium enrichment medium or enriched medium right answer is option b that is indicator medium and this McConkey agar McConkey agar has color indicator that distinguishes presence of acid Bacteria that ferment a particular sugar, example glucose in culture media, will produce acid waste on the plates and turn the pH indicator red. Okay. So next one is catalyst is not produced by Staphylococcus, Streptococcus, Proteus or Salmonella. And the right answer is option B that is Streptococcus. Catalyst is not produced by Streptococcus. So catalyst and enzyme that bring about or catalyzes the reaction by which hydrogen peroxide is decomposed to water and oxygen okay so this is the catalyst test and if the hydrogen peroxide produce the oxygen then it is from the bubble in positive reaction if the organism have catalyst enzyme then they produce bubble when we add the hydrogen peroxide in their culture okay like this and like this this is a positive result of catalyst test so move on to the next question that is the availability of an organism to utilize citrate as a sole source of carbon in simon citrate medium is indicated by appearance of growth blue color both of the above and none of the above and the right answer is option c that is both of the above appearance of growth and blue color indicate the positive Simon citrate agar utilization so here we can see this is the normal culture green <coughs> culture medium green color and if the medium develops blue color from if the bacteria utilize the utilize the citrate as a carbon source then it turned into a blue color okay so that is the positive result so move on to the next question that is Biological control used for moist heat is the spores of Bacillus stereothermophilus, Bacillus subtilis, Clostridium perfringens, or Clostridium titani. And the right answer is option A, that is Bacillus stereothermophilus. So, <coughs> change of color and turbidity indicates the growth in the ampule. This is the ampule where Bacillus stereothermophilus is present and it is 
put it into the autoclave or steam sterilizer steam sterilizer for the for to uh, verify the <coughs> or check check to check the uh, <coughs> autoclaving process whether autoclaving is done properly or not okay so if the color change in the ampule to yellow then we can say the autoclave is autoclave not done properly and if the color remains same as blue then we can change uh, then we can say autoclave done properly okay so next one is the biological control used for the dry heat is the spores of bacillus stereothermophilus bacillus subtilis clostridium perfringens or clostridium tetani and the right answer is option d that is clostridium tetani is used for the biological control for the dry heat sterilization and next one is the glutaraldehyde is used for the sterilization of bronchoscope cystoscope plastic material or all of the above and the right answer is option d all of the above and the last question is the following properties are plasmid mediated that is resistance to antibiotics production of enterotoxin fermentation of lactose all of the above and the right answer is option d that is all of the above are properties of plasmid mediated okay so these are the all questions and answer with explanation okay thank you for watching this video